Hi, this is Mike from Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and on today's video we're going to look at how to restore the full context menu when you right click in Windows 11. Keep watching to find out how. Okay, so in today's video we're going to take a look at how to restore the full functionality of the right click in Windows 11. Windows 11 at the moment, the right click is a pain every single time pretty much that I use it. I have to click on show more options and it's just a real pain in the backside. So let's go over to the computer and I'll show you how to fix it. Okay, so let's start off on the computer and I've actually put the details of this in the video description below. So if you want to, you can just copy and paste along with me. We've got a file here saying restore full right click context menu. Uh, actually, thanks to Dave Aitken, one of our regulars for pointing this one out. Very helpful indeed. So yeah, open up this, and um, what we're gonna to wanna to do is to basically open up a command line. It doesn't have to be an admin one, just a command line, or you can use the Windows Terminal or PowerShell, however you wanna do it. And essentially you're gonna to have to cut and paste, or copy and paste, this registry additive in here. So you can if you want to, you can use regedit if you wanna hunt it out and actually find that key, and you can basically change the key if you want to, but the way that we're gonna do it is considerably easier. So first of all, let's copy this section here. We're gonna right click and we're gonna choose copy, and then we're gonna open up PowerShell. Easy way of doing that, right click on your start menu down here, and then go to Windows Terminal. Windows Terminal will open up. Then you can just either right click and choose paste, or Control V, and there we go. There is the command in its full glory. Hit enter, and we should find after it says that it's entered successfully. There we go, the operation completed successfully. That is it, that is all we need to do. Now if you do not like this and you want to undo it, I've actually left in there as well, the option, so you can choose this section here, right click, choose copy, go back into your PowerShell or whichever you want to, paste it in, hit enter, and that will basically set it back to its defaults, but we don't want to do that. So let's go back to the first one again, hit enter, and there we go, so now we can type exit. Close that down, quick reboot or log on, log off of Windows, and you'll get your context menu back. So just for clarity, not sure if I actually showed it or not, but if you right click at the moment, you get this, and then you have to show more options, and then you get the normal thing. So essentially, we're gonna make it so this comes up the first time. So let's quickly log off. So the system's come back up again after being restarted. So if we go into our folders here, we go into the same folder, right click, and there we go, straight away. We didn't have to click on show more options. So all of our options there, properties, delete, copy, cut, paste, blah, 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 all those sorts of things. Happy days, love it. So there you go, nice simple way of restoring the full functionality to the right click context menu in Windows 11. Uh, let me know in the comments section, is it something which bothers you on a daily basis? I'll be honest with you, it does for me. Something I should add as well, this is only a user level change. So if there's multiple users logged onto the same machine, it will only affect the account which you actually run it on. It isn't a system wide change. So if some people like it, it isn't gonna affect them. If you don't like it, it will change for you. Anyway, that's gonna wrap the thing up for this video. I've been Mike, this is Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and hopefully we'll catch you in the very next video. Thanks for watching.